Okay, this is the package here. Um, just arrived today about 12.30, so I ordered it about, uh, probably about Monday, Monday evening or so. So just about four, four or five days or so, which is pretty good. Could be better, but it was just UP, or not the, the postal service, so it wasn't like express mail or anything. So um, this is the package here. It looks pretty good, you know, probably just dense from flying in the airplane. Um, the package originated in Israel, so which I was quite shocked at. As you can see, the labels there, it's got a little Hebrew writing and stuff. So, I mean, tape's a little ripped, but not, not too bad. So, well, let's crack this baby open. Be careful so we don't damage any of the parts inside. So. Now the Great Outdoors package or whatever, I got the, um, I believe it was a 31 inch hookah. And I got four flavors of tobacco, can't remember what the name, brand name is off the top of my head. Uh, I got a few packs of coals, some foil, didn't get tongs, but I'm sure I could just find some of those around at home. Um, there's some other stuff, in, I don't know if we got any tips or anything, so um, okay, this is the package here. It's not too bad. I mean, these are, this is probably the tobacco, and that's the hookah there, so it's not terrible. Could be better, you know, maybe a little few packing peanuts so this didn't roll around or whatever. So it's not too bad, but they are boxed, so it's, it's pretty good. Alright. Question is if I can get it out. This must be the uh, shisha and all the other stuff that I got with the package. Open this up here. Yeah, when I got the package, it didn't sound like anything was really rolling around, so it wasn't too bad. Or it didn't sound like anything was broken, so that's pretty good. Let's see what we got here. Oh, that's a goodies. That must be the uh, smokinghookah.com, where I got these must be the uh, foils for the bowls. Got some. Um, I got them. Um, what is it? al -waha. Shisha. Ooh, that does smell like rose. Mmm, that's good. Um, the last flavored roses tobacco I got, as my friend said he really liked that. I got a uh, peach. Uh, banana split, which actually I really want to try. It looks like banana, chocolate, and strawberries. And, um, hmm, I thought it was raspberry, but, oh well. Maybe that, maybe that is what raspberry is. I do not know. Oh, they have bubble wrap, very nice, so the coals aren't damaged, those look all pretty good. Got uh, six packs of coals here. Some uh, smoking tips. And, uh, oh, also, I forgot to tell you, this is a, um, this one comes, came with a, a double clay bowl. I don't, I don't know if you can kind of see it, it's a, so you can put two flavors in there. I'm not sure if I'm going to use that or anything, but I figured, hey, what the heck comes with it, so. This is a nice, uh, it's actually uh, smoke, exclusive to smokinghookah.com there, so it's got uh, packets and stuff where you can put that in there. Put all your tobacco and stuff, so we'll just throw that aside. Alright. Excited about this, first hookah ever. Alright, all right, this must be the uh, hookah itself. I don't really know if uh, that's a good company or not. I don't know. I'm fairly, pretty much new to this, so we'll see. Oh, it's got a nice little convenient carrying handle there. Not like we're going to be using that anyways. All right, let's open this baby up here to see what we got. Oh no, there is some packing, packaging peanuts in here. So where'd that box go? Just dump that in there. Here. I'm not sure what this is here. I'm guessing this is the bowl. Perhaps. Yes, that would be the bowl. Let's get that side so you guys can see what I'm doing here. 
a nice nice tray there. I'm making a mess all over my bed. Got the uh, cleaner there. I really want a base cleaner, but I guess that's what I have to do for now. Alright, got the stem and everything here. Doesn't look uh, damaged or anything. It's just a little... I got the blue one. Ooh, that's... Hmm. That's kind of cool. Interesting. Looks pretty... Looks in pretty good condition. Okay. The only thing I can see here... Get that up close for you guys. Is that... Uh, looks like the tray thing. Where the tray sits on. That looks... That, that's pretty... Uh, been up so that's the only thing I've been able to see so far I mean I guess that's fixable the pliers and it's not necessary necessary for the who could work so a little disappointed in that but all together got the uh, hose there not too uh, not too much up on my hose conditions so I don't know much about those yet find the base in here base up here. Where are my scissors? Oh, that's uh... That don't look too bad. Nice blue base. At least there, I don't see any uh... chips or anything in the glass. So I'll let you guys... Uh, actually, it's got a... Actually, it's got a sweet little... You can see that there in the light. It's got looks like uh, grapes there and a little little vine. So I didn't know that that had that those designs on it. That's kind of cool. So yeah, but um, no no chips in the glass or anything. So oh, I got some packaging peanuts in there, but we'll get that out later. So oh, I take that back. The hookah itself comes with tongs. So awesome. Looks like I got some little uh. In case they run out of foils. Got the little screens there. And the pipe that goes from the uh, stem to the base there. And, yep. That looks about it. So, yeah. But yeah, the uh, only thing I'm really disappointed in is just this. The base for the tray, where the tray sits there, is uh, just kind of bent up. I don't know what happened to it or... What, so, oh, and it looks like uh, there's a little indent. I don't know if you all can see that. Kind of right, right there, you can kind of see it. So, those are the only two things, but the grommets all seem to be in good shape and everything. I mean, you know, this isn't... I can just bend that back with the pliers. You know, it's not essential to the hookah working or anything, so... I'm not going to complain about that. I probably won't order... Me, myself, I probably won't order from this site again. I just ordered from the site because, you know, I like the package, came with a bag, etc., etc. So, there's a, I like hooking shisha, hookah, hooking, hookahshisha.com. That looks like a pretty good site, and uh, they have my favorite uh, flavor, which we have, which we've been smoking at the hookah lounge in uh, Toledo, is uh, Starbuzz. We really like the Starbuzz flavors, so. And it looks like they have some uh, pretty sweet charcoal on there, too, so I'm going to have to check them out once I'm all out of this stuff here so um, that's about it um, my friends coming over tonight we're not sure what type of shisha we're gonna smoke tonight which flavor so um, I'm probably just gonna leave that up to him and uh, we will get back to you for the um, first uh, shisha review for then for now see you guys later